you've helped pay for. Today, a special visitor was given a guided tour of the new children's hospital for Wales. Dame Shirley Bassey returned to her hometown to see how the cash donated from an auction of her evening dresses is being spent. Live now to our health correspondent, Sean Lloyd. Sean, you're all dressed up for the evening. Jamie, the reason why I'm glammed up like this is because this is being built as one of the glitziest nights of the year. Now, the guests are beginning to arrive here at City Hall. The event has been organised by the Noah's Ark Appeal to say thank you to Dame Shirley Bassey, who's due to arrive here shortly for her donation to the Children's Hospital for Wales, but will also be a money spinner for the future. Yes, yes. Seeing for herself the facilities at the children's unit at the University Hospital of Wales. This playroom needs updating, but it plays a vital part in helping young patients feel more at home in hospital, an environment that can be bewildering. Dame Shirley spent half an hour chatting to the children and their parents, and she couldn't resist giving five-month-old Leora a cuddle. <laughs> Touched today by the stories of the children she met, the Welsh diva has already shown her support for the new children's hospital, donating £125,000 from the auction of some of her favourite evening gowns towards the Noah's Ark appeal. Well, when you have children you know, of your own, things like that become very important. Yeah. And I come from Wales, so, you know, my gowns had to come home. And her visit was a boost for the patients and their families. She asked why the Ara was in, and which I told her, and she wished us all the best and hope everything would get better. And uh, she had a hold, and she was, I was thinking, oh God, don't be sick. <laughs> it was then on to the new Children's Hospital for Wales, a tour of the wards and the Children's Cancer Outpatients Unit, which her donation has helped pay for. I'm honoured that it's named after me, yes. very honoured. Uh, the the colours, I think, are very important. I think the kids are going to love the colours. Dame Shirley's contribution is being honoured tonight. It's made a massive difference to the fundraising campaign and we're going to be able to name the children's outpatients uh, unit after her, so she's thrilled. The ball to say thank you, the theme, Diamonds Are Forever, befitting the star. Fans will be travelling from across the UK to attend the sellout event. And this is the dress that I won at Christie's auction. All I've done is try it on. It didn't start, it didn't fit to start with, but now it does. But I can't walk or sit down in it. I can only try it on and stand there. And the total amount raised tonight will be unveiled on Monday. Well, things are warming up nicely here at City Hall, and I'm joined now by Peter Carey, who's going to be entertaining us this evening. Now, this is all very much in a good cause, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Noah's Ark appeal. Wonderful. It's um, getting money together, funds together, build a hospital for children here in Wales. Can't be fun. And what exactly are you going to be uh, doing to entertain uh, the crowds this evening? Singing a, a song from Les Miserables, uh, Bring Him Home. It's kind of... I thought it was kind of nice. It, and have you heard the reverb up in that room? It's going to be wonderful. <laughs> no, I haven't been able to hear it yet, but I'm looking forward to hearing it later on. I mean, how important do you think it is it that there is such a facility like this for children in Wales? At, at the moment, we're the only country in Europe yeah, without one. Exactly. Well, it's, it's essential. If any, if any of our uh, children, uh, God bless them, are kind of seriously ill, they have to be whipped away either by a helicopter or by a fast car ambulance uh, over to England or to wherever. It's crazy. Hey, let's get one here, sort it out. Well, looking forward to hearing you later. Now, let's go and talk to Suzanne Mainwaring. Suzanne, you're from the Noah's Ark Appeal, and that's really been driving the public fundraising event. It's been a, a long few years for you. How are you feeling tonight? Well, I think tonight we're going to celebrate. There's a lot of work that's gone in for a lot of, you know, four years and things, but there's an awful lot of people who helped us get to where we are today. And tonight, we just want to let our hair down and say, you know, this is a fantastic occasion, £125,000 for Dame Shirley Bass has done it and we're just going to have a good time and of course you're going to be raising more money tonight aren't you um, how is that happening uh, we'll be raising money from I mean, obviously through ticket sales um, through sponsorships that we've had and through money raising on the night but um, we're looking at sort of in excess of 20,000 pounds tonight so still smiling and very <laughs> briefly does your work stop here no we're definitely going to be carrying on no time to take a breather the hospital is always going to need um, support in the future families are always going to need support in the future and we hope people will stay with us Suzanne thanks very much and of course we're looking forward very much to Dame Shirley Bassey uh, arriving very shortly and I understand she may be singing for us Jamie back to you have a great night Sean thanks very much now they call the internet the information superhighway but in parts of rural Wales it can feel far from it when villagers and residents 
help pay for. Today, a special visitor was given a guided tour of the new Children's Hospital for Wales. Dame Shirley Bassey returned to hometown to see how the cash donated from an auction of her evening dresses is being spent. Tonight, Cardiff City Hall is the venue for a ball in her honour. The Diamonds Are Forever Ball is being held by the Noah's Ark Appeal to say thank you to Dame Shirley for her donation. Seeing for herself the facilities at the children's unit at the University Hospital of Wales, this playroom needs updating but it plays a vital part in helping young patients feel more at home in hospital, an environment that can be bewildering. Dame Shirley spent half an hour chatting to the children and their parents and she couldn't resist giving five-month-old Leora a cuddle. <laughs> Touched today by the stories of the children she met, the Welsh diva has already shown her support for the new children's hospital, donating £125,000 from the auction of some of her favourite evening gowns towards the Noah's Ark appeal. Well, when you have children you know, of your own, things like that become very important. And I come from Wales, so, you know, my gowns had to come home. The ball to say thank you, the theme, Diamonds Are Forever, befitting the star. Fans will be travelling from across the UK to attend the sell-out event. This is the dress that I won at Christie's auction. All I've done is try it on. It didn't, start, it didn't fit to start with, but now it does. But I can't walk or sit down in it. I can only try it on and stand there. And the total amount raised tonight will be unveiled on Monday.